Hello, my name is John Cohn. I'm the founder of Fit for 90, a soccer specific sports science and monitoring company that's partnered with US Club Soccer as a member of Players First. Last time we talked, we talked about applying the logic of sports science to player development. Today I want to talk in a little bit more detail about a core element of physical training, the stress adaptation response. I can't really overstate how important it is for us to understand this as coaches, as it's a key element in driving not just player performance, but our player development and maximizing injury prevention. As a coach, it's easy to think about this on a curve, where in essence, on the positive side, relative to our graph, we had performance adaptation. On the negative side, we have fatigue. The horizontal axis represents time. Each time we walk on the field, we have a group of players that are entering with a certain degree of readiness, their training readiness, so to speak. As a coach, we have to address where the players are at a specific point in time and match that readiness with our training stress. Now, depending on our training stress, we're creating fatigue. Depending on what we've done, we have an increase in severity, right, which is going to cause the players to go deeper in the hole, so to speak, and take longer to recover. This is specific to the type of work we do, as well as the overall load of the training environment or the match environment. Now, obviously, over time, when the players recover, we're going to get an increase in performance, a positive adaptation that leads to increased speed of play, for instance, which is a primary goal when we talk about soccer-specific performance development. How this compounds over time to, in essence, build up our team's player development is a key element of understanding stress and adaptation. We'll talk about this in more detail and how it varies across individuals within our group down the road. But it's a key starting point for us is understanding that each training day, the players enter our environment with a degree of readiness that we need to be aware of as coaches so that we can optimally hit the mark with each training, training session. Thanks very much for your time and I look forward to speaking with you soon.